So today we're gonna be working with some of the Hank and Henry products, which I love. And I'm doing kind of like a sunset vibe with the dark purples and the bright orange. And I hope you guys enjoy it, stay tuned. So let's start with today's makeup. And what I did already is I pulled back my hair because I can't stand hair on my face while I'm doing makeup and I already put my primer on my eyelids and I used Smashbox the 24 hours photo finish and then we're gonna use a transitional color because we're gonna be working with the King's Queen by Hank and Henry so I'm gonna be using a transitional color from Stalazi which is MB19 with a fluffy brush I am going to move it around and give it a kind of a smoother finish Okay, so once we put the transitional color on here, we are gonna use Privilege from the collection from Hanging Henry's, that's the King's Queen. And I am going to put it on the top of my lids with the same fluffy brush, because it's still the same kind of color that I'm using to transition. So, so far the King's Queen privileged, the orange is really, really nice. It's, it's really nice and orangey. It's not dull looking, like sometimes you put on oranges and they're like, like pale looking and almost, almost makes you look like orangey ash. <laughs> so then it's like, um, it doesn't look so good, but this is really, really nice. It's almost... It's really, really orangey, I love it. So I'm not really using color up here, I'm just blending it up to soften it. And then we're gonna be working with the Lady Soho um, collection with, uh, and then I'm gonna be putting on New York Nights. I just don't know what to call it since there's three eyeshadows in one. Um, so I'm just naming it by the top of the main one, which I believe is Lady Soho. So I'm gonna put, what is it called, New York Nights on my top of, on the top of my lid. It's a really nice dark purple, and it's gonna make that orange pop. Look at that! Look at that purple! It's Really, really nice. Now, I'm not doing a cut crease today. I want to kind of blend it a little bit, but not completely. Just kind of like a soft blend right there where it's kind of empty to transition them a little bit. Man, that purple looks so nice. I love it. I love it. And I'm not doing too much effort to like really put it in. It's like, it's going right in. It's beautiful.
So I'm gonna use in the middle, I am going to use a soft, like a mauve color from Stelazzi. Oh, I'm sorry, from La Femme. I don't know what number they are. Okay, then I'm gonna add a little bit of the New York Nights to kind of not deepen the purple, but blend it better. I have some fallout on my face. That's why I always do makeup after um, and the eyeshadows first because sometimes some things they just kind of the dust kind of falls on your cheeks and stuff like that. And that's really hard to prevent. And it doesn't mean that the quality of makeup is bad or good, it's just the nature of it. I mean, you are moving one product to another location, there it is expected to somehow, some way, fall a little bit. So, I mean, that doesn't bother me. That, that, that doesn't mean anything with the quality of makeup. So, so right now we have at least the colors there. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna put some pizzazz on there. So I'm gonna be working with the Lady Soho, the actual Lady Soho, the Luster Lights. So I'm going to press that on the purple um, to kind of give it a little bit of um, depth to it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a little bit of the Photo Finish Primer on my purple eyelid on, on top um, because it's not really glitter glitter. It's kinda, it's a loose powder. It's a loose, um, he calls it a luster, luster pearls. And I wouldn't consider it glitter where I think that it would need to adhere with some sort of glue. Um, so for now, I'm just gonna use the Photo Primer, um, the eyeshadow base. It's just enough to be tacky enough to, you know, get the glitter and keep it there. Look how pretty that is. Yeah, that's beautiful. I love it. Okay, so I cleaned out all my fallout. And so we can continue. I always do my eyeshadow and then I always come back to it after I finish my makeup, kind of tweak a little things and add a little here and there. Um, so I'm gonna continue with the makeup and then come back to the eyeshadow. So I am going to put the New York Nights underneath my eye area. Then I am going to kind of blend it in a little bit. Or should I say blend it down? So we're just gonna put on our eyelashes. 
I use J Lash um, from I Kate House. I think that's what it's called. Um, I love them because I don't like to spend too much money on eyelashes. I already have short eyelashes. Like, I'm not gonna be wearing eyelashes every single day. Like, I've accepted my truth. <laughs> I have short eyelashes. Like, there's no hope for me. This completes the look for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to hit like. Y nos veremos pronto. Bye bye.